Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, ladies and gents, in the background, I'm listening to a young man known as Yusuf L. He just put out a video, and from time to time, I will listen to Yusuf. I am doing this to give that young man his props, and I say this because he said about the Susan B. Anthony case, go and watch his video, I'm not going to talk about it here, but I did not know that this was discussed by the Supreme Court. Yes, I understood it, I know the aspects, concept, and I know the fundamentals, and I know the principles. Ladies and gentlemen, the fact that a Supreme Court and other court justices have said this exact same thing regarding what a United States citizen is, what the intent of Congress was when they created the so-called citizen. They originally created the United States 1871. There was never anything known as a citizen. The Constitution didn't mention anything about citizen. It mentioned the people of states. It did not mention the citizens of states. It wasn't until the 14th Amendment that we get to the word citizen, which means that there was an intent for use of the word citizen. Use of L goes into that, and so does the courts. I am actually glad that I turned on that particular video. Literally. Because it's what I was looking to bring forth. And the way the courts say it, they did the job for me. So, ladies and gentlemen, there are a couple of things. I had a 73-year-old person talk to me today about a situation he's in. He is versed in a lot of things, and I have encouraged him, told him that because he knew what he knew, that we can, we can break bread. I can't tell you what he asked about because that is incompetent. So, but I can tell you that he knows a little bit more than the rest of you. But he knows just enough to be stuck. And I know just about enough to unstuck him. Did you say unstuck him? That's right. Why didn't you just say unstick him? Because stick him is a wrap. And I can't do that. Stick him. You know, I can't do that. So, all right, ladies and gentlemen, as I said, before I'll say it again so that you guys understand it. That young man said about four things in that one video that will educate you. So, Yusuf L, give that young man his props. And those of you who know him, let him know that I said it, that I do have a lot of respect for him, and that's why I keep mentioning him, Jonah Bay, and others like him. Ladies and gentlemen, he is providing the information for you, telling you where you can look it up at. He's proving what he's talking about. So why wouldn't I point you in that direction? All right, without anything be said, being said, have a good day. I got to get ready for a meeting. That's how I break from things. All right, take care, everybody.